I'm not that big a fan anymore. I wanted to see it. I don't want to see it every other day. wanted to show you guys they are in the same cage together so we're gonna keep an eye on them and see how that works out I'm excited and this one is empty mm -hmm. okay so don't mind the toaster oven Arlo's making she's got this is like a workshop in here okay we're making shirts she's making this she's making cups she's making tumblers she's making mugs but I tell you what I did I bonded these two. So I decided to put um, Ray inside Melvin's cage this morning after I cleaned it. And um, he's, been in, he's been in here ever since. And that has made me so fucking happy. So the girls are eating. And I think these boys, oh, <laughs> sorry. I had a great workout today. I, oh, let me show you the cups that Arlo's making, just to let you know. These are the cups. Look, it has my name on it. There it says Dana. It's a 20 ounce tumbler with a metal straw. Those are gonna be available in our Etsy shop soon, just to let you know if you're interested. I just made myself a hot espresso with some steamed heavy cream. Um, only a tablespoon this time. Um, today is a low fat day. I mean a low carb day, so it is a higher fat day So I probably could use two tablespoons, but I just used one. I've got my electrolytes here. I had a great workout I did shoulder and back shoulders and back today so I've got all my drinks going on over there. I'm gonna eat later and uh, Yeah, everybody everybody's fed the kids ate um, like earlier today um, about an hour ago they were hungry, so I fed them early. Sammy had uh, cheddar broccoli soup left over, so that's all gone. Um, and then I made her like a bagel on the side. Austin had, he made his own. Well, I made a ribeye, and I gave it to him because I didn't want it. So he had that. And then he made himself a uh, baked potato and uh, some buttered noodles. So he had that. He's upstairs. Guinea pigs are fed. Dogs are fed. I'm going to sit my ass down with a heating pad and just chill the fuck out. It's nice and sunny, but it's supposed to get really cold. And me and Austin were outside, uh, un, like, digging out Arlo's car um, and laying some salt down and, you know, doing the driveway because she had work today. So, yeah, that's it. No, say hi. Say hi. My name is Chloe. Hi, my name is Chloe. Hello? Hello? Hello, my name is Chloe. Hello. She is so not amused. I don't think she likes the camera. Good Tuesday morning. Um, Arlo is packaging up some orders. We're gonna have to drop at the post office some shirts that people ordered and uh, we're gonna go get a hot Americano from Starbucks. Yeah, and then we're gonna go to um, like a thrift shop really quick. Um, the one in our town and then we'll come back home and I'm gonna make us some tuna wraps on low-carb spinach and herb tortillas and uh, We'll have some pork rinds with that Some marinated onions, which I did last night mm. And for dinner I'm making pork wings. I'll show you when we get home what they look like I want to say I've showed you before but I'll show you again um, We bought them from Costco a little while ago some pork wings and some steamed broccoli and butter. That's gonna be dinner. I'm gonna give her one portion of macadamia nuts. I'm gonna have a portion of macadamia nuts. And that'll be our food for the day. Uh, lots of water, lots of drinks, lots of coffee. So she is over there somewhere. And uh, it's a rainy day, but the only good thing about it is I just warmed the car up just now, started the car, and all of the ice that was there last night is now no longer. So, because I couldn't break it up yesterday. It was so hard to do. So, all right, we're back. We didn't go to the thrift shop. Um, <clears throat> we'll go tomorrow. 
Because we have to go out tomorrow and get Chloe's medicine, so we'll be out already. Might as well just do that shit tomorrow. I just wanted to show you that. So we got these on clearance and Target. The other day we just bought one box and then we had them on Sunday on our carb up day. And we had them for breakfast and they're individually uh, served. You know, the packages are just one it's serving size. I don't know why I'm having some trouble with that. So this is what they look like. Steel cut uh, better oats and they have flaxseed in them, just plain. They're not flavored with like sweet shit. Um, they are 22 total carbs, three dietary fiber. You do the math per serving. That's not too shabby, especially for a carb up day. So we, we got seven more boxes. <laughs> we took them all because they were still on clearance and they were only $2.71. So got that. Uh, I wanted to show you the pork wings that we're going to have for dinner. This is what they look like. We get them from Costco. They're absolutely delicious. I just throw them in the air fryer here. And uh, yeah, here are the macros right there. Yep. Good shit. Love them. The flavor's amazing. We're going to have that with some steamed broccoli and butter tonight for dinner. For lunch, I've got some marinated... Uh, Marinated red onion going on here, Emily. You like the bowl, Emily? Do you like it, Emily? You know you like it, Emily. Not for the price, but you like it, Emily. <laughs> um, I've got some solid white for me. I made it spicy, so I put some Cajun seasoning in there. And then this is Arlo's. She likes that chunk light bullshit in vegetable oil. Disgusting. Don't like that. Little bit of lettuce I'm going to put on low-carb wraps. This is the spinach and herb. We absolutely love this one. So that is what is happening. I'm going to have a pickle with mine. It's nighttime now. It's 5.51. <sighs> so I've got, you know, things going on in the kitchen. I'm going to be making that TikTok pasta. I mean, you guys know. It's not the pasta that I'm making, but the, the method. With the feta and the tomatoes and the garlic and the, you know, you get it. Um, look at that. i got to do some of that. Uh, so... I'm doing that and we're having that with edamame pasta. I'm making some chicken in the little fryer back here. I'm just going to be breading that with the isopure again, extra protein. And uh, I made the kids some chicken noodle soup right here. And uh, whoa, they, I'm gonna make Austin um, chicken with us and then he can have a chicken sandwich. And then I'm not sure what else to make Sammy, but. Maybe she'll just have the soup and crackers. I don't know. She's weird. She doesn't really like when you give her something else with it, like a sandwich or something. She doesn't even eat sandwiches. I don't know whose kid she is, but she ain't mine. Um, but, so that's what's happening. Arlo is busy over there in our Etsy shop situation. She's doing her thing over there. I'm cooking. It's, you know, it's the use around here. Uh, that's pretty much it. We are just enjoying this Wednesday. We're supposed to be getting snow tomorrow. I mean, come on with the snow already. I'm actually sick of hearing about it. Uh, so that's happening. Ask me if I'm happy. No. So I'm hoping when I wake up tomorrow morning, it's not snowy so that I can take the DOG for a W-A-L-K because I'd like to take one as well. It's an off day from my epic workouts on youtube so i i'm gonna make it an uh like an active you know off day but not very active just a walk 30 minutes call it a day but i still want to move my body um so that's what's going on we're we're just doing doing all the things here anyway i hope you guys are doing well happy hump day all right so dan is listening to her stories and uh i'm gonna show you that pasta, well, we use the anime mo uh, Eddie. <laughs> Shut up. She's giving me a look. Edamame pasta. And she actually added some uh, mushrooms. And then this is just um, chicken breast uh, breaded with uh, seasoned isopure. Or isopure unflavored that she seasoned herself. Doesn't look so good. Dana says it's really good. Mm -hmm. And for her to say it's really good, it's really good. That's it. I'm going to stop talking. All right. So it's not really the end of the night, but it's the end of the night-ish. That TikTok pasta. Hmm. I mean, you could try it, but 
we weren't really a fan. Eh. Take it or leave it. Eh. I think that the um, we'll never make it again. the the feta just overtook the flavors. Yeah. But uh, that breaded chicken, man. Woo. That was the start of the show, baby. Oh yeah. So I would have been pissed if I only made that pasta. I'm glad I made something with it. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm on the computer. Dana is watching Unpolished. Does anybody else watch it? It's on TLC. I freaking love it. Unpolished. Working on some new shirt designs. I don't. I don't know what Dana's watching and why she watches it. But that's pretty much it. We'll see you tomorrow. Just follow every move. Touch me Let me know you want it to Don't have what you need Alright, good Thursday morning. Does anybody know what's happening here? Does anybody know? Look at this shit. I cannot with the snow. There's a lot of it too. Look at the table. There was nothing on that table yesterday. Ugh. I'm not that big a fan anymore. I wanted to see it. I don't want to see it every other day. It's just ridiculous. What time is it? I gotta wake Samantha up. Yeah, I gotta go wake her up. Hold on. Alright, so it's Friday. The 12th, the Friday before Valentine's Day. We just got home, again, it's like three o'clock. We had uh, some oh, hard boiled yeah. eggs yeah, oh, um, yeah. on the road this morning. We had to pick up some stuff, go to the vet to pick up her meds. We went to go grab some sushi. We went to the post office. We went to go get more ice. I mean, not ice, rock salt. We went to go get Chinese food for the kids. Well, for Samantha. It's like three o'clock and we're just getting home. So it's supposed to be like an icy mess this weekend. So one of the reasons why we had to get more rock salt and um, we're having sushi tonight. What else? What else could I say? We took the dog with us. She's been with us she in the was, car. For the, like the first forty minutes, she was a pain in the ass, but she was good after she was that. A pain in the ass. I'm just kidding. But uh, she was so good. Yeah. I'm gonna go and um, do some computer work. All right, go ahead, Samantha. And then, Wait, so oh, yeah. we have to watch uh, The Blacklist tonight. Good girl. I'm so no, excited. Not now. Wait. And okay. You can wait. I think that's You're it. This. We'll show you your sushi okay. later. Okay, so this is what we got. All right, thanks. Bye. <laughs> Just kidding. Sushi. Oh, can I do this? Mm-hmm. We asked for. Uh, no rice mm -hmm. and we also asked for no crunch okay no crunch. if you guys don't have instagram aren't on instagram you guys will get that reference but uh rainbow and this is um with some eel and avocado that's salmon skin mm -hmm. and then just some uh sashimi actually they they were like twice the size I just uh, split it with Dana. Jesus Christ. And then I like seaweed and and then we have some pork belly and here's that spicy mayo. We have some seaweed too. So we're just gonna, I guess, eat with all this. And this is our little uh, Valentine's Day uh, dinner. Dana didn't have to cook. Well, mm -hmm. she did that. Mm -hmm. I think it's like after 12 huh 12 30. uh so arlo's watching a night's tale a night's tale i was not watching that um that's definitely more her speed of stuff i don't really eh, i'm good um i do like keith ledger though but i'm not a fan of the movie uh so we're going to bed i'm tired <laughs> We have had a really nice day. Uh, a lot of errands in the morning, but things needed to be done so that tomorrow they don't need to be done. And I'm sorry if I'm greasy, but I just washed my face and oiled my face. So, we're going to bed. We'll see you in the morning. And, uh, toodles. Good morning. Happy Saturday. I think it's Saturday. Yes, it's Saturday. 
happy Saturday. I am just woke up a little while ago. Um, gonna probably I'm putting all the dishes away in the dishwasher. Dishwasher? No, the dish drainer. Because I want to make sure there's nothing in there. It drives me crazy when it's like piled high up and you can't fit another thing. Yet you try. Um, I don't know. Did, I know Arlo showed you our dinner last night. So we have pork belly for this afternoon for dinner. Well, tonight. She has work. Supposed to be crappy weather here today. Um, like, I think we're getting like an ice storm. The weather is really just bleh. Um, I know it's winter time, but geez. I think it's in the last two weeks I've seen more snow than I have seen in the last three years. And now we're getting ice tonight, so whatever. Anyway, I'm going to probably stay off of uh instagram today kind of give it a break there's a lot of micro dots so i'm going to be filming more on here because i need to uh make sure that i can edit this video tonight so that i oh did i not clean that yesterday no i did not damn it my shaker bottle that i drank my electrolytes out of i forgot to clean it um, <clears throat> so I'm going to give it a break from here today, I mean on Instagram today, and be a little bit more on here so that before Arlo goes to work, she can upload all of this footage and I, I can edit it later. So there's that. I'm sure you wanted to hear all of that, but you know, this is real life here. <laughs> Just putting away all the shit that's in the dish drainer. Um, anyway, so I'm going to make some coffee and I will record it on here, but I'm not going to record it on Instagram. Like I said, I'm going to give, a, give it a break. So, coffee time. All right. It's still, I think, morning. It might be afternoon. No, it's 1230. Uh, I am making Maria Emmerich's, uh, these are her egg wraps. They're quite durable. They're made with hard-boiled eggs. They're made with uh, regular raw eggs in a neutral bullet with some coconut oil and seasonings of your choice. Um, you know, it's in her uh, dairy-free cookbook, this recipe. So if you don't have that, I don't know what to tell you. Then you got to go get it. <laughs> um, but that's what I'm making. And then I am also making... Uh, these are going to be wraps, so we're going to put some lunch meat in, like some provolone cheese, uh, some ham, some uh, rotisserie chicken breast, like the sliced kind, lettuce, marinated onions back there in that bowl. Anyway, so that's what's happening. We're going to have some pork rinds with it and a pickle. Uh, dinner is just what we had last night. Not the sushi part, but I showed you. I want to say I showed you guys. So, the, ow, Louie, Louie. The boys had a quarrel because I was cleaning out their cage and they were eating a lot later than what they're normally used to. And so when the little guy is hungry, he gets a little like wacky. Uh, and Melvin, I guess, and him got into a bit of a quarrel. The little guy had some of Melvin's hair in his mouth. So I'm sure he like, they were fighting. The teeth were chattering. They were doing it. They're right now fine, but... He's very food motivated, the little guy, so if you kind of don't feed him, like, right away, he acts a little crazy. So, yeah, there's that. Um, but everybody's good now. I'm washing their fleeces. I cleaned all of their cage and their fleece. Their guinea dead fleece are in the dryer. So once those come out, I'll put them back in the cage, put their little houses back in the cage, and uh, everybody will be fine. Anyway, Arlo's probably going to put this footage on the computer because I am going to edit later. So, yeah, that's all. Hi. All right, so I was doing some work on the um, computer. Dana did some rearranging in there. Um, I want to say that you guys have seen um, this egg wrap before in last week's vlog. If you did not, I will show you again. Hold on. So here are those wraps. Um, the egg wraps, the, uh, it's Maria Emmerich's recipe. 
We also have some uh, ham, turkey, some cheese, I think there's some lettuce and mayo under there, and also some marinated uh, onions. Mmm, so good. And then we have, we haven't had these in a while. Um, there you go. Southern Recipe Small Batch. These, mm, these is, this is the, sorry, what is it? What is it? Kimchi Barbecue. Korean kimchi barbecue flavor. These are really good. 